Have you been struggling looking for instrumentals and karaoke's or have you been trying hard to figure out drums of a song from its original track? If yes, so we have an interesting tool for you, which is Splitter tool from BandLab. So what does this tool do? Splitter tool helps you to extract bass, drums, a cappella and other instruments from a song track. You must be wondering how would this help me? So let us know. First thing, this is totally free whereas other online premium tools are paid. Also, it gives high quality output of splitted stuff as compared to online paid or free tools. Now, talking about how it can be useful for different people. So, for the people who make cover songs, you can generate an instrumental for any song you want, whether it is latest song or it is an old song. For the people who want to figure out what instruments are used in a song, this will help them to get to know how the drums are made in any song they like. Now that was all we could tell. Now let us try using it. So to access this tool in your mobile phones, you must have BandLab application installed and have an account signed in. Now we will show you how you can access this tool inside the application. After opening BandLab application, simply click on the plus icon located at the bottom center of the screen. This will open create tab inside the application where you can see various settings like recent projects, track type and tools. Below the tool setting, you can see an icon of splitter. Simply click on the icon and this will open the interface of splitter tool. At the top of this interface, you can clearly see the use of this tool. Also at the center of this tool, you can see an option to import a song or track which you want to split using this tool. I will simply click on this option and import a song. Here you can see my song is currently importing, so I'll wait for few seconds for the process to get complete. Whilst the importing process is going on, the tracks will be splitted automatically and you will see a screen like this. Now this is your vocals, this is your drums, this is bass and this is other instruments. There are 4 tracks your track got splitted into. Now you can listen to a single track by clicking on this S button which is called solo or else you can mute any of these tracks by clicking on this M button. By muting this you can listen to the other three tracks or other tracks which are not muted. Now if I want the instrumental or karaoke of the imported track then I will simply mute this vocal track from here and now I have got the karaoke version of my imported track. Now let us hear the karaoke. So this was the quality of the karaoke track splitted by the splitter tool. Now let us share each stem one by one. So here is the drum stem splitted by the tool. Here is the bass stem of our imported track. Here is the other instrument stamp separated by this tool. If you want the vocal stem instead of the drum bass and other stem then this is how it will sound. You've been running around, running around, running around, throwing that dirt all on my name. Cause you knew that I knew that I knew that I'd call. Now, by adjusting these bars, you can adjust the volume of a particular track. Just like I'm moving the bar, that means the highlighted portion means how much is the volume of the track. If you want to export these stems then you can simply click on this icon located at the bottom right corner of this interface and the stems will be exported in the form of single audio file. Just make sure to mute those stems which you don't want in your final audio file. If you want these separated stems inside a new project of your BandLab app, 
Then you can simply click on this icon located at the bottom left corner of this interface. After clicking on the open in studio button, all these stems will be imported inside a new project of your BandLab application. From where you can do further modification in these stems or you can take an audio track to record your vocals with your separated karaoke stems. It's all up to you. So these were the uses we could think of but there are unlimited ways in which you can make use of this tool. But kindly keep in mind to avoid misusing the tool.